power scaling in Dragon Ball that are just stupid. First off, the strength level between Buhan and Kid Buu. It makes absolutely no sense that Kid Buu is stronger than Buhan. Obviously with the fact that Buhan has consumed Gohan, and yet getting rid of that makes him stronger. Even Grand Supreme Kai was still pretty strong. I mean it says that Kid Buu is the most destructive, but even that has to do with power. Second is Vegeta's strength from the Sand Saga and his strength when he was a child. Now when Vegeta was a child, his strength was minimum 11,000. And in the Sand Saga, he was 18,000. That's not that big of a jump. I mean, he was basically considered the strongest Saiyan alive. I mean, until the movie came out. And now that's considered the canon one, even though it makes less sense. And of course, there's Broly. So you're telling me, after Goku and Vegeta get to train around two decades, up to the point where they can reach around the power of gods, and this man can fight them just normally? Tell me in the comments below what stupid power scaling moment stuck out to you. I know there's more. I know there is so much more. 